Hello my loves, I know I've been a bit MIA. I definitely needed some time to myself and I've actually been missing filming so I thought I'd vlog and I'm gonna give myself a little bit of tea. I'll see you when I do my nails. I'm actually gonna go do my hair because it's really bugging me like this orangey tone. I just wanna go back to jet black back to black i just really miss my black hair and i'm also going to do other stuff in the week just to take care of myself and you know my sister passed her exams so we it's kind of like a prayer where we say thank you i've done a video on this already guys but it's so yum so i might actually eat some right now i actually need to get a little bit of rice it's like milk rice just waiting for my food to heat up by the way my pyjamas are from Primark my sister went and got it for me I'm definitely going through like, a tough phase I would say but now I'm trying to just get back into things and you know motivate myself to um, do things and not just lay in bed all day and obviously work has been keeping me really busy as well but I just really miss filming because and editing and creating so yeah i'm gonna eat my food now i haven't vlogged in so long my vlogs are actually the type of videos that i really like looking back to so i need to do more of it but although there's not much to do especially if we're going into another lockdown so yeah i'm gonna eat my food that's my food it looks very green <laughs> um but this is a coconut and mint chutney i think it's so good but yeah i'm gonna demolish this yellow and stitch is the best Oh, I wonder what, who all these toys are for on the floor. Oh, are those all your toys, Luna? I love watching Disney films to feel better. I demolished that. He's sleeping. Oh, it's all this mess. I bought this table <laughs> for filming guys, so I thought I'd unbox it. Guys, the table's actually really, really sturdy, and I got this for like fifty pounds. And when I'm done filming, I can just fold it and put it away. So yeah, really pleased with that, although it was a pain. But now that I know how it opens and closes, it should be fine. Honestly, the amount of money I spent on Uber, I could just save by passing my license. Oh yeah. <laughs> Troy's finished my hair, he did such a good job. Look at that shine guys. It looks so cool. Um, so yeah, I'll leave his page in the info box if you guys want to book with him because I put a picture here of what he did with my hair before. Um, and now he's managed to get it back to black and then like if I wanted to go back to light I could because I didn't use a box dye, you know. And he has his own like kind of like studio which looks so sick. Look at these looks so nice i can't believe he has his own like kind of like studio good morning everyone today i'm going to be filming honestly this rainy weather is not motivating at all but i'm gonna have this for breakfast actually because i'm trying to live my best life okay i've got some left and i love this one this is like the best one i think Okay, I'm gonna give you food, okay? Look, fur everywhere. I've been drinking more kind of like 
coffee in the morning like straight black coffee but i forgot how like tea smells so good in the morning i used to drink tea all the time and then i like mine quite milky that's it in and then I've got my donut to put that in the microwave for like five seconds so it just gets unstale. This is my cup that we all use. It has my grandma on it. How cute is that? Okay. A donut and a cup of tea is definitely the best thing. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to talk to you guys about what what I've been doing to really kind of help with my, I would say my mental health, like just to stay positive and not feel like so slumpy every day and literally like sad. Um, I've been going through like, I told you guys I've been going through kind of like a rough patch, honestly, like the past month, I would say. Um, but not like the whole month there were some good bits but like i've just had this overwhelming pounding feeling in my chest in my tummy just this sad feeling that i'm trying to like get over so the first thing that i actually really turned to was meditating and that really really helped actually um i don't do it every day but i did it quite a few times uh, i did it I do like five or ten minute ones. I also looked into a lot of tarot reading, like your card reading, your astrology um, kind of like reading based on your star sign. Mine's Cancer. Um, I'm a super needy, emotional kind of person, which just fits right in with my star sign. But um, yeah, I've been doing that a lot because it just, it just kind of comforts you that you know someone out there is giving you some insight or some clarity into what's coming um, and sometimes it's actually very accurate it's so weird I don't know let me know in the comments below if I should pay like an actual tarot reader the third thing is watching a lot of kind of like childhood happy films so like I was watching Tangled on Disney a bunch of Disney things like Frozen, Tangled, Lilo and Stitch which really reminds me of like my childhood just things that make me happy because I do watch a lot of horror and thriller things and honestly I did watch a couple when I was feeling really bad and it just made me feel worse especially when I watched that American murder film oh my god the most traumatizing thing I've ever watched and the fact that it's real is insane like I just like the guy just seems so normal like a normal person it's just so depressing so traumatizing and i kind of regret watching it actually because it just it's just so scary um so yeah that was a big mistake for me to do because i felt even worse after so i definitely i'm gonna try and avoid watching like thriller horror, horror films or like scary documentaries um when i feel like this you know because i've felt like this before in the past and the I come onto my fourth thing where I just tell myself like this is going to pass like this phase is going to pass and it always does get better and I try to think that God doesn't throw a situation at you that you cannot handle um, so I try to like tell myself and talk to myself um, as much as I can fifth thing is I just eat what I want I eat what makes me happy I went through a phase where I was not eating and I lost weight and that is so unlike me if you know me, you know Anushka does not not eat, okay? I eat all the time when I'm sad, when I'm happy, when everything. And there was a period where I was just not eating, I was just eating once a day and it was just so weird. I'm having a donut for breakfast. Another thing which I actually haven't been doing and which is also not a good thing because working out was actually kind of like a good way for me to release all this energy right and i haven't been doing it um i don't know why but i need to get back into it so today's sunday i'm gonna monday we're gonna start and i'm definitely gonna feed my body more clean food so yeah i think the last one will be working out and i know that once i start doing that it will help i wanted to talk about this because i know i'm not the only one i know many of you that are watching this video are probably going through a rough time I know that some of you do because you message me kind of like your situation at the moment and I just want you to know that it will get better.
you know think about all the tough situations that you've been through in your life and that you've gone through it this is just the same thing basically so my october look fantastic beauty box came in i actually pay for this and it's it comes to 13 pounds monthly because i got the 12 month renewal plan so everything that i've got today comes to 58 pounds and i only pay 13 pounds which is such a bargain i actually might try this out today um they've got some foot cream which i always get excited about what is this we've got a by terry gloss got some soothing serum by balance me some bath tea which i actually don't have a bath so i'm going to keep this for a giveaway and we've got a soft hair wrap a towel wrap i always get excited about these boxes um honestly and i actually do get, get gifted them so whenever i do i keep them for giveaways for you guys but i definitely recommend the subscription and if you guys want to you know sign up i do have a um discount code and a link in the info box if you guys want to check it out well i live in these um comfy clothes all day every day so it's monday morning and i got a few pr stuff that i thought i'd show you guys you know this one luna got from the door like if you see something if you see something come through the letterbox she'll go and grab it i got this new air volume mascara by l'oreal i can't wait to try this and it actually came with some hubba bubba gum um so when luna bought it i'm like why does this smell so strong and then it was just this guys you have you ever had this before like if you haven't then oh my god where have you been living it's basically gum really excited to try that is that my little sky so the next thing that i'm really excited about i put too much gum in my mouth for the new wishful get even rose oil which i'm super excited about i've been really liking her skincare it comes with like a pipette so yeah that's all i got i didn't get much actually actually got a new phone believe it or not i've had the same phone for like three years now actually no it, it must be more i think it's been four three or four years on the same iphone x and it's just it's just just coming to its end point like it was so annoying the pictures are were awful oh so i got the midnight green 11 pro max I really like the camera on here because my husband has this phone and I always use it. <laughs> you know, because I was like, okay, I don't need a phone. I'm going to pay £20 Simone contract um, and be good with my contract. But then I'm just like, actually, you know what? I actually need my phone a lot, especially when it comes to social media stuff. So I can justify the spend, you know? I love my black hair, guys. I actually got a case to fire case, which I'm really excited. I personalised it as well, so... Yeah, I really need to go to the toilet. I know it's a bit TMI, but I need to go to the toilet, okay? I need to go. I've gone past my toilet time. <laughs> I will catch you later, guys. All right, guys, it's Friday evening, and I just needed to put a bit of skincare, so I thought I'd show you guys. I also need to do my nails, because they're so bad. But before I go on to that, I'm just going to do a bit of skincare. So I'm just going to use some of the Good Molecules Hyaluronic Acid Serum. So yeah, I'm just gonna do my nails quickly, which a bit have a bit of maybe like modern family in the background. I've been loving the wishful moisturizer. This smells so nice, like it's very lavendery, but I never thought I'd be someone who likes the smell of um lavender. There's something so relaxing about it. I'm also gonna use the new wishful uh, oil. This is the get even rose oil, which I'm really excited about. I'm like already a big fan of the Wishful Skin products. Like I love, oh my god, this feels so nice. Enzyme scrub. I love the moisturizer. This feels really nice already, but I need to use it a bit more. And the only thing that I haven't used a lot is the cleansing balm, but it does remove her eyeliner really well. But yeah, my skin feels so nice. As I was saying, this is what my nails are currently looking like. They're so grown out. And I love this brand of nail polish. It's by Blue Sky. I get these on Amazon. And today I'm going to be using... I don't even know what shade this is. ND12. This has been on for like a month now. It stays on so nicely. But I'm going to take these off now. I'm going to be filming tomorrow. So I just want my nails to look a little bit cute, you know. 
this is just not it oh my god i was just scrolling through netflix and i saw that haunting of bly house is now out oh my god i know what i'm going to be doing tonight guys so this is what my nails are looking like i've honestly been trying to find this kind of new transparent kind of shade for the longest time and this is just perfect it's so natural it just looks like my nails i'm obsessed kind of messed up this hand a little bit you see like there's like bumps but it's all good anyways i'll see you guys tomorrow because we're gonna pop out i'm gonna like i said i'm gonna go get my pajamas i don't know if this vlog is really that special honestly but hopefully you guys will like it i'm gonna finish my feet and go and make some food we're in h&m right now and i got some jewelry I'm just picking up some jewellery today because I'm going to film later but these are so cute it's got like shells on it and everything so yeah my sister's actually filming a reels right now taking her sweet time guys I'm literally back in the queue because I found this cute t-shirt I love friends and it was the last size M so I just feel like it was meant to be guys I got the t-shirt for £11 because they have a last day promotion in store got a 15% off instead of the 13 pounds I got it for 11 which is a bargain how cute is this t-shirt but I've got too many like cartoon t-shirts now but 8 pounds not bad excuse me Hi. this is the fit today guys oh my god it's just so cold but I love how black my hair is my sister's gonna get this robe <laughs> we're at Clark's now and my sister's trying some boots do you know? Hello? What did you do? What did you do? Oh, what did you do, Luna? Oh, you're meant to be in your bed. She got in trouble. And she snares like when she's in trouble. Do you know what did you do? Oh. Little mini haul here, guys. Got some drinks. This is my starter for my lunch. Some chicken and coriander sauce. I've got some chocolate covered raisins. The MS ones are like the best. Roasted cashews. Chocolate eclairs for my husband because he likes that. And I love these candy floss grapes. If you haven't tried it, it kind of has this aftertaste of candy floss. It's so weird. Um, and then I got this because I really like this, and it's like the small version. And I've got a bunch of these um, pasta things. I'm going to have one now. I think my most favourite one is this one. Which I'm going to have now. So then, for my Primark, I got some socks. Um, two pounds. Some tights. I like the thick ones. So I got the 100. That was four pounds. I got some slippers. And these still really hard, but they're actually really comfortable. And then I got... Uh, these pyjamas that I've been dying to get. I mean, I've been wanting Primark pyjamas and I got these two. And then I got a Real Techniques uh, sponge. So yeah, that's it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this little vlog. And if you want me to continue do doing weekly ones, then let me know in the comments below. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and like this video and I'll see you in my next video. <laughs> okay, bye guys.